everybody and welcome to this week's video. As you know, one thing we love to do at ISL is to celebrate the many festivities that you find around the world. And one of the events that is becoming bigger and bigger in ISL is the annual Cherry Blossom Festival, organised by the Japanese community. Um, it does seem to get bigger and bigger, as I say, even to the extent this year that we have some students, and Ms. Tamako, who have been working on a, a new Japanese garden at the front of school. So this is a really special year for the Cherry Blossom Festival. And we have some students, and Ms. Tamako, who is the head of the Japanese department, to tell us a little bit about it. Talk first of all about Cherry Blossom Festival and why it's important, and then also talk about some of the things that we're doing this year. So I'm going to pass to Ms. Tamako. Thank you, Mr. Parker. Um, cherry blossom is very important in Japan because this rep represents uh, Japanese uh, uh, kind of soul uh, because this um, cherry blossom season is very short and uh, um, we feel you know, life is short and then we have to enjoy while you have it. Um, and it's also the April, May, uh, March and April is Japanese um, beginning of the year and then also end of the year. So cherry blossom is uh, represents these, you know, um, goodbyes and time of change as well. Um, thank you. I've said that I've been very lucky because I've been to Kyoto um, at this time of year. So I've seen the cherry blossom out in Kyoto and the parks around it. It's just beautiful. Um, so. Uh, so we're now going to hear a little bit from the students. So I'm Kairi Mogi and I'm in grade 11 and on Wednesday afternoon all Japanese students are going to make some traditional food in Japan and uh, our grades which grade 11 are going to make some something similar to the pancakes and we'll make matcha powder in it so uh, I hope you guys enjoy to have some traditional foods on Wednesday. Um, I'm Yumai Nada from grade 10 and as Kairi said, we're making a traditional food sauce in the Cherry Blossom Festival at Wednesday. And our grade 10 are making something such as like fried chicken and yakisoba which is the noodles. And like yakisoba is commonly represented in the festival in Japan, in the stalls. So if you would like to join us, please come to eat the uh, foods. Thank you. Yeah, I should say that one of the special things every year is, is the Japanese food. It's just really nice and, and it's, it's just really enjoyable. So in, please enjoy if you come. Okay. I'm Haruka, grade 11. So for this year, um, me and some other Japanese students in grade 11 made a Japanese garden in front of the reception and we wanted to share our culture and beauty of like Japanese tradition by creating a physical demonstration of Japanese culture. <laughs> Thank you. Um, I'm Risa from grade 11 and um, <clears throat> each object in the garden has different meanings. For example, the gravels, which are like tiny stones, which represent water and we're gonna put like a huge rock in the garden which also represent the mountain. Um, we also have some other features like shishiodoshi that's make, that makes like a very calming sound and relaxing. Yeah, so as I said, this garden that's being constructed is a really special feature of this year's festivities. But there is more going on as well, we have a show. I'm Coco in grade 10, uh, so it was hard to make the costumes. Uh, and I'm Shiho in grade 10, and when I was searching the what to do in the Trey Person Festival, um, I found the YouTube video of Super play of the Super Mario Brothers in the Japanese high school. And then I introduced to other Japanese students in grade 9 and grade 10, and then the Mario is going to be, so we decided to do the play of Mario, and then I became the, one of the leaders of the play. And I also made the um, background music of the Super Mario Brothers. I think 
um, most of you know some of the sounds of that. And then, actually, I have never edited some audio or vid video, so it was my first experience to do that. But I made it, and then it was a great opportunity and experience for me to do that. Thank you. Yeah, so this show also gets bigger and bigger. There's also, there's music, there's performance, there's great dancing as well every year. So uh, we're all really looking forward to it. So I'd just like to thank everyone for coming today and, and just say how excited we are to look forward to everything that's happening this week. Thank you all. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.